So tell us um, why you're interested in this position as the executive director of ErieNet and what you hope to accomplish in this new role. Sure. Um, I was interested in the position um, because about a year and a half ago, this was approached to our town, um, the town of Eden. It's rural. Uh, We have connectivity issues down there. We also have um, no competition, so we only are offered spectrum. Um, That creates some challenges uh, financially for some people. It dries up costs. But also we've been trying to attract manufacturers to our town, and without having uh, that type of infrastructure built, we've been having a hard time doing that. So I noticed the problem. When I saw this position came up, it was something I was passionate about. It was something I thought I could use my leadership skills for and uh, my government background working on projects and infrastructure. So I applied for it. What do I hope to accomplish? Is that your second part of the question? Um, Obviously, we hope to accomplish the whole the whole business plan um, they have a really great business plan we're hoping to do 400 miles that connect everyone throughout the county it's a middle mile other companies such as Verizon and Spectrum can utilize it it will bring areas that don't have access now um, everybody has the right, everyone should have a right it should not be a privilege to have internet and I think we need to get that mindset um, to everybody so that they understand and that there are people out there that literally cannot connect to the internet and in 2023 that's not acceptable anymore so our goal will be able to bring uh, manufacturing to rural towns be able to connect someone who has a longer driveway uh, be able to make sure that every single student that goes to school has the ability to connect to the internet those are our goals and i'm excited to be a part of accomplishing that